chromatin versus chromatid. Every organism, including us humans, are made up of cells, the basic building blocks. These cells contain hereditary information in the nucleus in the form of a DNA. Now, talking about DNA and chromosomes, we often come across various terms which are very confusing, like chromatin and chromatid. To clarify the difference, let us consider a cell which is inactive or not in a division state. Its nucleus looks something like this. The genetic material of an inactive cell looks like an intertwined noodle and is called as a chromatin material. Looking closely at the chromatin material, we can find that it's actually DNA associated with proteins called as histones to form a bead on a string-like structure. This array of DNA-wound histone beads is actually the noodle structure of chromatin material. Hence, we can say chromatin is a semi-condensed form made up of DNA plus proteins. Now, when the cell comes into active state, it prepares itself to divide into two daughter cells under the process called a cell division. These daughter cells, as we all know, must have equal and same number of chromosomes as the parent cell. For example, if the parent has n number of chromosomes, the daughter cells should also have n number of chromosomes. Now, in order for that to be possible, the cell doubles its number of chromosomes during the cell cycle and each chromosome makes copy of themselves, which are now called as chromatids. The chromosome and its copy are then joined at the center to form the X-shaped structure, called as the chromosome, and these two chromosomes are now called as sister chromatids. These sister chromatids, during later stage of cell division, divides from one another and are given to each daughter cell. Thus, we can say chromatid are actually chromosome and its copy made during cell division by the cell in order to divide equally among two daughter cells. Whereas the chromatin or chromatin material is the semi-condensed genetic material in a cell before it condenses into chromosome and is made up of DNA and proteins. This video took a lot of hard work so please don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel.